Okay, final video, part 12, and quite an interesting group, I gotta say. Um, the shirt, this is for Yanis, my fan subscriber who sent me this Greece shirt that I decided on. As we'll see, there's Chelsea and there's Pauk in there. Of course, I have the Chelsea jersey, but with Pauk in there, it didn't seem right. Didn't want to wear a Chelsea jersey, I didn't want to wear a black and white jersey either, so I went with the Greece jersey. It satisfies both. It's the Greek jersey that I got from Yanis, who is a Pauk fan, and it's the colors for Chelsea. So there you go. I think I got it all in one. Let's look at those teams right ahead. We'll start off, of course, with the Chelsea home jersey, uh, which is very interesting interpretation for Chelsea. You have the blue with a little bit white and red in there, like horizontal uh, strokes. I find it very interesting. I also find it interesting the same thing is repeated on the back. Uh, really nice jersey overall. I uh, gave this eight stars. It's not a traditional one, but I overall like it. Take something new. Also fits with the sponsor. Of course, the sponsor could look a little bit nicer. Um, the away jersey I also like a lot, although I don't find the red Y of the sponsor fitting that well. But there is something about, about the yellow with the blue that really hits a spot with me. And although it's not, not as splashy as the home jersey, it looks classic Chelsea to me. Don't ask me why, just a personal feeling that I have. Really great jersey. Um, and for that I also gave this 8 stars and I feel very comfortable with saying that. Chelsea also issued a third jersey, which in typically Nike fashion uh, in 2018 has a print of Southwest London on there. Um, I gotta say the color, although very in similar to Atleti, it is actually the closest that any of these kids have to a club color in kind of this minty green bluish. But then with the orange, yes, Chelsea had such a kit in orange and gray, I think in the mid 90s. But something is just not quite right with this one, honestly, with the horizontal striping and then uh, it's just too much. I don't like that one. I'm only going to give this uh, three stars. And then we go to Greece to Pauk, which was supplied by Macron, which actually again deliver a really nice jersey. I like the overall feel of it. You have the black and white stripes as it should be, a little bit more Barcelona striping as I call it. Um, I actually like the modern um, crew neck with this V here, which is in grey. And what I like most is that the sleeves also have the same striping. That makes for a great jersey. I know that on the back it's uh, blacked out, which I don't like that much. And I also found the kit font a little bit uh, crazy. But there's another touch that I like on it. Similar to, I think we saw the, was it, not Villarreal, uh, Levante. The striping is, uh, has this shadow striping in there, which kind of gives it um, a little bit more texture and a little bit older, more classic feel to it. Really like this one. I actually would like to have this one. That would fit nicely in my collection, I think. I'm going to give this nine stars. It's a really nice looking shirt. If the black back was also striped, then I think I would be comfortable with 10. The away jersey, however, has the classic look. It reminds me a lot about the Lazio home shirt in a way, but I don't like the colors. I don't like the gray. Yes, it's the mixture between uh, black and white, but not only is it gray, the crest is grayed out, and the only thing that really is black and white is the sponsor and maybe the sleeve cuffs. Um, I like the style of the shirt. I don't necessarily like the execution. For that, I give this only five stars. Yeah, number three, Bate Borisov from Belarus, which is also the sponsor here. They play in our favorite Adidas template in yellow and with blue accents and very similar to Astana uh, in the previous video. However, it's a stronger blue and I think it looks even a little bit stronger for that. But other than the shirt is boring. Uh, Color-wise, it fits very well. I don't necessarily like the red spots. I think a blue one would be better. And, you know, we know it's a template, six stars. And I don't have a picture as of now. Maybe if I find it, you will see it right now. 
but the away jersey I think is just an inversion of the colors has been for the past few seasons so I expect the dark blue with yellow which actually will look quite nice but um, also I don't think it will, I, I would go higher than six stars on that one it's a template but there will be the sponsor on there probably a little bit missing could be potentially be a seven star um, if I really see it in person and then the last one is from Hungary. I think it's the Hungarian champions. Uh, they used to be known as Videoton Sekes Feherva. Sekes Feherva. Uh, but now they're just FC Vidi, which was always the nickname, which I read is not very popular among the fans. Uh, the home dress is this half and half look. I don't necessarily like that the sleeves are the same color on both sides. Make the sleeves also switch color. Either make one side all red, on all blue, or then Make, for instance, the left sleeve on this shirt uh, red. The sponsor is also with the green. If that was navy, I think I could live with it more. But overall, I think it's a nice shirt. Gonna give this seven stars. The away jersey, I like the pinstriping. Again, the sponsor is a little bit messing with it. And I wish that it did it, what France in 2010, to switch the colors a little bit up. It's just too, too blue heavy. A little bit more red. I know the sponsor is red, but I think in the design itself there could be a little bit more red used. Still, really nice design. It's a classic Adidas design with the pinstriping. Also seven stars. And they have a third jersey which takes the blue concept even one further. You have now, this is the white jersey in light blue. Again, make it red stripes here and we talk again seven stars, but this is a little bit too boring, honestly. No, not bore, boring is the wrong, but I don't like the color combinations. Uh, especially since red is the other club color and you only see it on the inside of the color. For that reason, I go on the six stars. That was it. All Europa League jerseys. We did it. Let me know which jerseys you liked here, whether you agree with my assessment. Also, let me know what's your favorite Europa League jersey. From my ratings, I cannot say at the moment, but we have, have a look at it. Give me a thumbs up if you liked that video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these. And we're going to start Nations League soon, and maybe I will wear this shirt very soon again. Up until then, bye.